good morning. So I think my tree out front heard me say that it was ho-hum, and it's putting on quite the show right now. I'm up early, I'm gonna cook dinner tonight, making my butternut squash soup. Kate's not involved in this one because this is my recipe. In the last video, I didn't show off our kitchen. It is tiny, so here it is. So for the butternut squash soup, the ingredients are butternut squash, an onion, raw cashews, unsalted work just fine as well, vegetable broth, cream cheese, cayenne pepper, white pepper, chili powder, garlic powder, and kosher salt. I spared you the peeling of the butternut squash because all that was is me cursing about how slippery they are as the skin comes off. So just roughly chop the squash up and the onion. And that's the dog's share. The butternut squash makes a good treat for them. So one of the best ways to get the seeds out of the squash that I found is just a spoon. It just scoops in there real nice and cuts everything right out easy. And then just rough chop the onions. Then just dump everything in the crock pot. And three cups of vegetable broth. I want to give a huge shout out to my friend Chris for making the music in the background on this video. It's really nice. The seasonings are all to taste, so it's good to add a little in now and then again later. And the lid goes on. Leave it on low for five to six hours or until the cashews are soft. Now be sure to stir it occasionally. Once it's looking like this, it is time to put the cream cheese in. Just cube the cream cheese up, drop it in, and then you'll use an immersion blender to blend it just to keep the number of dishes down. I used to put it in a blender and that works just as fine as well, but then you have a blender to wash. And here it is, all blended. Now's the perfect time to double check the seasoning, add whatever might need to be added, and then we will put the lid back on and then let all the flavors bloom on low or simmer until you're ready to serve.
Does anyone know anyone with a cooking YouTube channel? I would love to pick their brain on how they set things up, because this is complicated. The soup turned out fantastic, everyone loved it, and I hope that you'll enjoy this recipe. If you make it, let me know. And I hope that you like and subscribe this video.